Just uh, exploring, scrapping. Um, I'm a pretty big noob. I don't use power armor, but I think. Okay, 168 out of 215, and I'm level 61. I don't really have a build. You know, it's, it's just kind of like a mashup of everything. I probably should, but... Oh. You get a new slot at 75, do you? Okay. So I have, some, I have a lighting mod on, and that's what's causing the, the flashing like that. Uh, I might get rid of it, I don't know yet. Yeah, I've got a few mods. i got like 30 or 40 mods. Like, you can't really mod the game, but you can use the existing textures and mess with them. Like, for instance, I have the Vault Girl mod. I've got um, my health bar at the bottom is broken up like that. But I've got, like, the lock picking interface. So you'll see a few things like that. Like, you can mess with, like, existing stuff, but you don't really have a tool set for modding. Just kind of make the game a little bit more of ease for you. You know. Like, for instance, um, I, uh, I have a mod that... Me edits the meshes for the hair it goes long like that but that's pretty much all you can you can't make a you can't add in a hairstyle from nowhere like like a custom hairstyle mod it's just not possible oh this uh doggo is gonna give you trouble I was able to headshot some ghouls near here for, with that crossbow, but I won't have much luck. Yeah, these guys. I'm surprised that Super Mutant can even say Appalachia. To be honest with you. Oh my god. I forgot how overtuned uh, mutants were in this game. Yeah, just kind of chilling out today. I'm doing, um, Mass Effect 2 tonight. There we go. Well, now, what do we have here? I don't think I have a pipe rifle right now. Oh, my other character has my um pipe. That's what I th that's what I remember. Yeah, I was wondering about that. I have a level 25 where I'm actually half a build. And I thought it was on that character, but that's okay. We're gonna keep doing this. Ghouls, you always want to hit in the head. Yeah, so for this character, I actually have the VATS targeting. But for my other one, I don't. So this is kind of nice. Oh, someone got him. Sure wasn't me. You know, I always kind of laugh when people call this game next gen. You know. <laughs> sort of like a buzzword that Bethesda likes to use, next gen, and they don't know what next gen means. 
you know, they call the Fallout 4 update next gen. It is not in the slightest. I would consider a completely over, like, massively modded Skyrim to feel like next gen. You know, well, like with the animations, the graphics, the EMB, but like even Starfield, I, I would not classify that as next gen. Oh, this guy's going to be difficult, is he? I don't know. Okay. I didn't even hit this guy. Am I like missing every shot? Yeah, like the targeting system I have from my Skyrim file feels so nice and even the smooth cam feels so smooth in comparison. I wish smooth cam would come out for Fallout 4, that'd be so cool. Maybe in a few years, you know. It's gonna, feel, it's gonna feel very weird and jarring, you know, going from overly modded Skyrim to Test 6. Even though Test 6 is gonna be brand new. You know, it's gonna have that Bethesda jank. Yeah, for some reason they completely overtune the super mutants in this game. But they're super easy in like uh, Fallout 4 and 3. Fallout well, New Vegas too. Uh, this feels like really weak. Yeah, I'm like barely hitting them. I guess I should put more points into strength. Um, I actually like the fist quite a bit too. Uh, somebody has a rocket launcher. Ah, oh, there are so many guys here. Excuse me. Too many. Just too many. Yeah, like this face breaker is pretty cool, but yeah, I don't like whenever I see mutants, I just generally try and avoid them because they're way more of a hassle than it's worth. Like for losing some, you know, healing supplies. Is that what I use? Like six stim packs in there? It was an absolute waste. Yeah, I've got 35 now. I had like 54 yesterday. I ran into another super mutant outpost and yeah, it just never feels worth uh, the effort with them. Another thing is like the robots are over tuned too. It's really weird. They changed the tuning on this game. Like robots and super mutants hit like absolute trucks. Getting hit by like a freight liner. Big 18 wheeler smacked in the face. Not a fun experience. That's kind of why like Fallout 4 feels better. I feel like it's kind of evenly balanced. Like Super Moons do hit hard later on, yeah. But they aren't like insane the way in this game. Like you have to have a party to take out like a huge base. Yeah, see that, that that's okay. The uh the gauntlet. But I should probably start putting perk points in strength. But I hit my cap at 50, so do you like Yeah, I've only got two in strength. And I don't know if you can actually reset your attributes. I don't think so. Yeah, I've got like a million in luck. 13 in Aji, 10 in Int. 
but I think this character was sort of going for like a sneaky style playthrough. Then I realized that stealth kind of sucked. <laughs> you know, like I need a lot more endurance and strength and agility. Yeah. Um, but my other character. Hold on, I'll just switch out for a sec. was some um, a little bit better stats don't need private adventure today i actually need my stuff to sell in my market i put a bunch of fusion cores up i've got like i don't know 30 fusion cores somehow i found and I, like i said i never use power armor so they're pretty much useless for me so put them up on the open market and i wish you could just sell them straight for caps but i actually don't know where to do that i don't not very first to all in this game. I'll play like every year for about a week, maybe a week or two. You know, go hard and then I get like ridiculously bored. So Fault First kind of actually works for me. It works well because I only play for a month and, you know, money doesn't accumulate. Like I'm not playing every day all, like all, all year long. So like this build, I was starting to put points in strength and kind of going even here. Oh, I don't know I had that. Um, yeah, because the my first character, obviously, you just pick whatever looks cool in your tree. And I've already got um, the same weight as my level 60 character. And I think I actually have better weapons too. Mostly. But uh, yeah, I'm just going to go back to my level 60 now. I just wanted to take a look at that. I might actually put away that um, one weapon I have. Oh, I don't have a photo gallery? Really? Truthfully, though, I probably should have uh, watched some videos before I made a new character again. Yeah. But I would imagine you probably need intellect to... Get, like, power armor perks, maybe? I would think. Uh, but I should be leveling up soon. Yeah, I'm almost level up. I'll take a look at the stuff then. I should focus on my guns, not my, my melee weapons. I should probably put those away because they don't. I mean, the the fist is okay, but that two hundred just uh, feels very weak for being legendary and a two handed. But it's also level. So this is level 50. Oh, it's level 50 as well, but it's also minus weight. But this thing's like three stars, and that's only one. You know, and it's... Feels like it hits a lot harder. Right, so... Let's, yeah, totally messed up on my build. I uh, just kind of did what... I treated this game like Fallout 4. Or, you know, I just jump in and blow up, blow my points everywhere. And uh, kind of discovered that doesn't really work. But I'm not ever, not never going to raid ever. Like I played this game like I play Fallout 4, like it's the same way I treat it. It's just, you know, it's bigger than Fallout 4 and there's more stuff to do, but it's like very grindy, you know, continuous updates, continuous things to do. You know, Fallout 4, you reach a certain point and you've searched every single building and done every quest and you're, you pretty much just start over after that. At least with this game, there's content to do all the time. And if you ever want to play with like friends or viewers or whatever, you can do that. You know, that's nice. It just, it can get boring after a bit. Like it's the same thing too. Oh, beavers. 
That's a lot of ammo for this game. I've never seen that much ammo in one bag. The only thing I wish if they would have added um tool set to make your character look better. The default vanilla models for their games are pretty bad. Not even like simp mods, just like textures would be fine. Yeah, you're playing a third person game, you know, it's sometimes kind of hard when you're stuff doesn't look that great. Ooh, like really bright here. Vile tick. How vile are you? Looks like a spider. Did he hit me that hard? Come here. Nah, not really. I think. Am I just diseased? And how do you... Uh, how do you see what you're... Oh, there we are. Is it a, why is it just a different tab? Hydrated, well fed, noisemaker. I guess I just, uh. Taking residual damage from that guy, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I, I really need to boost up the strength. I mean, it's at plus three right now for my, my gear, but. Strength and endurance is so low, it's almost embarrassing. I didn't even think about that. Like my health. That's why I'm dying so much from the, the mutants, I bet. So I'm going to level up. If I can put a point in, that's good. But if not, I might start a brand new character and focus on strength, endurance, and agility. And then everything else will come into place after that, I think. I think the reason I went so far into luck and perception maybe was for like the lock picking, the loot, the ammo weight, you know, re reduce junk weight, increase carry weight, that kind of stuff. Let's have that mutated. Target acquired. I would say you have a face. Only a mother could love. Except who's saying that to me? Already died. Oh, he's insulting me on purpose. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. You have been insulted. Oh no. Look, like I haven't had that happen before. Those ticks. Uh oh. Oh no. Yeah, it looks like I'm just taking like residual damage. Oh, that's a big one. Like a big blood explosion. Yeah, see, this is one of the mods where it's a little bit easier. AKA, very easy. Off you go, so don't get claimed into oblivion. It's like, how do I get over there? Oh. Well, that was pointless. Suffering food loss from. Do I have? Oh, I did. There. 
Yeah, I'm feeling right as rain. I don't even know where we are. Okay, where have I not explored? I'd say that little bee thing to the... Wait, where am I here? So was that, I was at that cabin already. So let's... I don't know, go southwest, I guess. I'm gonna get swarmed by rad scorpions in the middle of nowhere out here when it's like this. In the rocky areas. There's a really weird lighting bug. That must be in my mod. Like it's doing that. Like that's the MP. that's my reshade, but yeah, weird. So we were there before. So let's. Is that a person down there? Oh, it's an NPC. Bobby pins on you. It would make my life easier. As many as I can get my hands on. What do you got on you? Beggies can't be choosers. Sometimes one is all it takes. Silver locket. Ooh, yum. What's crap he has? I've explored all I can over here. I don't know. I'm, uh... Where have I not really gone? Like, down here. Yeah. Put it in here. Alright, self. Yeah, there's not as many rodents, not as many people. I kind of thought when those NPCs added, they'd have like a lot of raiders around everywhere. But it's pretty much like at select locations and then the open areas are like very woefully empty. Like there's just nothing. You know, like Fallout 3, there's so many times where you can get attacked out in the open by, like, random stuff. But in this game, like, it's... They're mostly just stick to their areas. I guess they didn't want to script a bunch of stuff in, but... You know, you kind of want to keep people... Interested in playing. My loot uh, window is not working right, I don't think. And also, like, I could do a new build for this game, but am I really going to play that long? You know, for like two months? Probably not. Like I said, we're going to do Fallout 4 next week, so. I don't know. Like, I try, I really try and enjoy this game. I try and go back every once in a while. Really weird. Like it's it's my game where I feel guilty about quitting or uninstalling, but I also like feel like I'm not getting my there's no value in my time. Because you know you're collecting, you're looting to to what end? You know it's like I've seen I've seen people on Twitter that their levels have been like eighteen hundred. And there's, that almost depresses me because that's like to what end? Like what? What do you get out of that? You know, like there's raids, sure, but you get the best loot, right? Then what do you do once you got everything? Just run around the uh, ganking people, I guess. The same for an MMO, though. But 
Like at least the MMOs, you know, there's like, there's fun in it. Uh, how do I get in there? There's just like some key I'm missing. I don't know. Take a look. Man, there's so much clutter. Oh my god. A lot of it, some of it's actually like unclickable garbage clutter. Feels like a waste. I don't know what that weird symbol is. I don't think you can get the key from in here. Gotta be from somewhere else, maybe. Starfield actually doesn't have long loading screens. It's just like there's a million of them. Just feels like there's a lot. Oh, that's weird. What's that building? That would kind of suck if, like, you spend your, your perk points, you know, the, like the attribute points, in the wrong spot, and then there'd be no way to reset them. That would be awful, like, because you just wasted your time if you, like, did a really bad build. Lost Engineer. I don't like that sound. Almost sounds like a moth. I think my days of using melee might be over for right now. Is this like a Halloween thing? What the hell? Level up. Okay. Yeah, you can't, uh... Can't put any more perk points in. Oh, that's too bad.
I guess you just get to pick a random perk, I suppose. You know, let's filter by... Actually, let's filter by endurance. Oh. I don't have enough points to even equip stuff. Yeah, my build is really messed up. I kind of wonder if there's like a stat reset I can get. Why is my thing still loading? I think. Yeah, like I really wish I could just get a reset. Oh, reroller. So I'm like, oh, it's just a weekly challenge reroller. That's stupid. I don't know. I have no idea. Just go with it for now, I guess. Should have put way more points in endurance. Not even strength necessarily, like some points in strength, but. Yeah, you feel kind of bad because you spent so much time. Not so much. Like, I'm only, I don't know, 20 hours maybe. It'd be kind of cool if they had a time counter for you. I do not know what the purpose of this place is. I'm actually going to muck around on my level 30, which I originally was doing on my last stream. Because I think I got frustrated with my level 60 character because I was getting hit so hard all the time and... Ugh, you know, dying, not doing very much damage. Hair overweight all the time, you know, stuff like that. And I think I was following this guy's guide on YouTube. It looked pretty cool. Because he was like just blasting stuff like crazy by himself. It was a build that was for solo play. Which is a thing. And it's good that it's a thing. I don't really have the intention to play with people or in groups. Like raid groups. Yeah, I guess we'll just go with this for now. Oh, I didn't have my armor equipped. Weird. All right, so what was I even doing around here? So note yourself, start putting more points in endurance for sure. North. Yeah, because right now, see, I've already got three, six strength, three endurance. I think charisma is useless. So I've kind of got level. I might actually leave my perk points alone a little bit. Like I might spend two points in endurance the next two levels and then hold on to my points. Look at that guide again and see if it's, uh, see how close I am to it. 
Um, the last time I looked at that guide though was like in probably 2023 or 22. So I don't remember 100% what the rest of the points were for. I might actually have to go find that again. Yeah, this is the gun I was using. I remember now. Okay, yeah, I was playing this last year. On YouTube, I remember. I just I haven't played in a long time. I actually have more healing items than my character does. He just like walk away. A silly guy. Just say no to copyrighted music. I guess the rights to those sa those songs cost so much that it's probably not even worth it for Bethesda to like pay for the rights. And then like people that play it in their streams wouldn't even get any benefit from, from that. They would still get copyright claimed. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Well, I know like Bethesda paid to have it in their game, but. You know, to be able to play it without incurring the wrath of the copyright laws would be a lot of money. And coffee. Oh, that's weird. My game's like stuttering a bit sometimes. That. I was actually having that on Fault 3 the other day. I don't know why that is. Weird. You go. Lady, where you at? She like ran away. I already think I actually have that dog food perk. Yeah, <laughs> good doggy. That's like the best one. So you gotta save all the canned dog food. It heals so much, like it's crazy. I actually didn't believe it at first when people were talking about it. With the dog food build.
I don't even know why I'm collecting all this money. Pretty much all I do in 76 is just, uh, yeah, play it like four. I haven't seen any people at all. Like, normally, like, I remember when I was playing 2020, you might see one guy every 20 minutes or so. Like, there's people's camps, but I just don't, uh, I don't see them ever. It does seem like a lot less people are playing now. Maybe there's more in console, who knows? But, uh, yeah, it seems like not a lot. A month or so ago, you could probably see a lot of people. There's the whole, uh, TV show hype stuff. I'm just gonna prop this somewhere. Too far away. And then I had space. See, that's why I like this. It's just convenient. That is way too much ammo. Same with this. If I have any fusion cores, I can put those away too. I think I put them all away in my, uh, my house. Okay. Yeah, I think I got frustrated with my first character there. At level 60 and I just... Combat got a little... There was a huge difficulty curve right around level 50. very apparent like right when you level up Skyrim is the same way too Skyrim had that like level 40 or so but then they start putting all the uh, crazy enemies like later on I don't want to make too much so this uh it expires who does this in this game yeah fall four is funny you can like make food and it'll be good for like months on end yep so i think i had when was it oh, my other character that one, yeah. Okay. This tree symbol, is that like a park? Oh. Give you guys the full moon there for a sec. Deathclaw Island. Oh, that this sounds like a nice place. Sounds like a place I would take uh, all my friends. So some armor pieces are only like the under, oh, like under parts, which is. Oh, this is the ghoul outfit. 
from the show. I forgot about that. And some of the stuff is really ugly. Yep, there's a there's a death claw. They've never been super strong in making good looking gear, unfortunately. I feel like Skyrim is alright, like there was some good looking outfits in that. For real? I can't. Uh, I don't really want to do that. Hey, where's my base at? There? I think I was exploring. Attention, citizens. Oh no. Nuclear strike imminent. Where are they nuking? Exit the area at your earliest convenience. Thank you for your cooperation. Oh. What's even down there? I see people nuking all the time. Okay, so he's 373. That's... That's like someone who plays casually, right? But like, other than him, I don't... ever really see people. Like, you'll see people's camps everywhere, but... The likelihood of running into someone is very small. Oh, an angler came into my base. Well. Hopefully my turrets are still working. Do I really need this much? Probably not. Oh, power armor. Yeah. That would be my my carry weight. Ultimately, though, I don't really like carry weight as a gameplay mechanic in these kind of games. Like, I don't know. I feel like you're being overburdened all the time. To the point where you have to, like, constantly go back to your base to put stuff away and... And then they give you a stash limit, like, I don't know, I just feel like there's so many systems working against you. This doesn't, doesn't feel very productive to me. Stupid ant. Where are you going? Run away from me. Okay, why do they have small ants in this game and not the big ones like in Fallout 3? You know, they could have just like reused the assets. I don't know, it just seems like a waste, you know? Giant fire the breathing ants. Don't see a lot of mole rats, but I think they're all our mole rats.
Mothman. Yeah, so my other character had a really good melee weapon. I don't think I ever found one for this character. I'll uh, keep an eye out though. I would love to find one with like very much reduced weight like that power fist. I might even put it away in my bank for now until I can get points into strength. Rip. Yeah, I love this gun. Oh, that's a Meyer Lurk up close and personal. God, that stutter is just driving me nuts. I don't think I had no, I don't have anything running. Must be some setting in my NVIDIA panel. This happened on Fallout 3 as well. You know, you can keep your dirty fedora. I don't want it. Yum, straight sugar. Why didn't he get up? Like, he should have heard me come in, right? I think the game might be not functioning as intended right now. It must be just in deep sleep. A super nap. Finding screws are so hard to come by. So those fans are pretty much your best bet. Oh my god, there's so many markers. Like, where am I going? What am I doing? That's just a repeatable quest. Let's go here. I got medics. Yeah, I was using that quite a bit. I really want to scope for this thing. So you need a pattern for it. In order to get parts, you gotta dismantle guns, and in order to dismantle guns, you gotta have carry weight. I love the nearby corpses thing from this game though. I really wish Fallout 4 had that or someone would mod that in. It's so useful. Trying to find stuff. I'm actually really surprised there's no mod yet. That's like one of the good things this game has.
Garbage. Kind of leaving this area now. There are rat scorpions in that tree line there. I accidentally ran into one once. Ugh. And then there's like actual rat scorpion caves as well. Getting there. Slowly but surely. You know, if they really want to make bank, they could add in like a bunch of hairstyles and outfits. And I know people would pay for that. But it's weird though, like they just they spend time on other stuff that You know, like, yeah, they try to get on game, M game content for people, but I'm sure people would definitely pay money. Uh, um, I think my field of view is, oh no, it's 80. Okay. It, lo it looked a little funky, but a little too close at times. That's fine though. 80 is us usually what their default is, I think. Camp Lewis. Where are we going to Camp Lewis? Uh, chops and purified water. Wait, is that right away and not we're getting rid of stuff very fast? There we go. That's better. Yeah, I've, I've already liked this character a little bit more. I don't nearly take as much damage. But also haven't hit that level 50 um, gap yet. What? Camp Lewis up here? Or am I just... Anything for experience, I guess. And he's gone. Okay. Hey, it's so convenient. And they know that. Bethesda absolutely knows that. Because the stash box, you can put unlimited amounts of stuff in it. But it has to be like resources only. Don't really need that, do I?
Uh, apparently I have a perception. Wait, you can rank up? Oh. I feel really dumb. Bro, really? I didn't know I could do all this. I just saw the thing light up in the corner there. Wonder. Can I rank up any of these? Wow, I feel that. Yeah, I feel feel like a big noob now. I didn't do that already. A radio. Thought it was loot of some sort. I'll take it. And I actually think I have a scrap. Yes. I thought I did. Miscellaneous, maybe? Got a repair kits. I thought I... That must have been on my other character then. Well, I mean, I can run down the hill and... Crap all this junk. Actually, instead of running down the hill, I think I can just pop it down somewhere. Almost let me place it there for a sec. I think it has to be like not where there's buildings. That looks a little nicer, I think. Oh, still overweight? Let me guess. Some stuff I picked up.
Level 20. Level 20. Okay. I'm sure there's a bench here somewhere. Dog's just hanging out sleeping here, I guess. Well, this is quite the camp. Apparently I'm not getting rads by sending in this stuff too. Heck, crimson water. Place is woefully lacking on benches, I think. Give us a drivable vehicle if you wouldn't mind. Right, never mind. There's nothing there. Well, it's all good. I've walked across the entire wasteland with full encumbrance once. You know, worst is you have to stop every however many minutes. So, is this part of this? Yeah, looks like it. Just dogs, no other enemies, I guess. looks important. Is that the same one that I was chasing earlier? This looks like the kind of place there would be a bench. Oh yeah, that stutter is so weird. You know? Just like every once in a while for like half a second, but it's not stutter, it's almost like the hertz just drops. The hertz rate. Let's 
Do you like even these guys shooting me? Doesn't hit as hard as it was on my level 60. Yeah, like it's just feels much better to play with some different stats. Wait, what does he have? 38? I don't think I have a 38. One's better condition. Let me just pound down seven bowls of soup. Whole lot of nothing in here. Oh, that was weird. It just didn't, it wouldn't open. Oh, it's broken. It didn't go anywhere. Oh, what a waste. Oh, here's a bench. And I'm still over comfort. I don't think I really need that armor, but... Okay, what, else, what else have I picked up that's... Uh, weighing me down? Let's sort by weight. Yeah. I bet it's the same as my other character where I'm just like carrying way too much aids and food. Put ammo. Excuse you. No, I don't know what's weighing me down. Pretty much everything in these kind of games. Probably too much right away, too much of everything more than likely. Yeah, it's just gonna drive me nuts. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna let me put it down here.
Put all the stuff away. Yeah, apparently food and drink will and aid will weigh down the most. Which doesn't really make a lot of sense to me, but how do I know? Hey, purified water, obviously too much. I also have lots of oh maybe I can cook some of this meat up. Oh wait, I can make a bunch of time. Here, I'm used to playing Fallout 4. You know, it feels kind of like there's interface lag too. There's like almost a one second delay when I'm doing a lot of stuff. There, right, that should be better though. 186. 30 minutes. Sure. Okay, that should be a little bit better. Yeah, my arm's busted. I gotta. Go to a bench for that. That chest piece I had was just like weighed way too much. And how much does it really protect you? Who knows? Like in Fallout 4, it was just kind of superficial. I kind of miss the days of Fallout 3 armor and Fallout New Vegas armor. Where it was like an armor piece was like you didn't need five different pieces. But I might be the only one that misses that kind of armor structure. Let's see if I can snipe you. Scan also isn't the greatest in this game. You know, like it feels like this, it doesn't really match where you're shooting sometimes. And the tracking feels weird. Yeah, it doesn't feel the greatest as a shooter, to be honest with you. Like, if you guys are going to play a looter shooter and a first person, I would probably just play Destiny. Like, if you really like Fallout, then... Yeah, play it if you want. But honestly, you probably... I'm better spent playing Fallout 4 and getting mods for that. Unless you're playing this with friends, like every day. 
or you know like a guild or whatever oh that's nice Fogger, you just ruined my weapon that I use all the time well I think I'm gonna log up for the day thanks guys I really appreciate it I had fun but uh, it doesn't feel like a great shooter to me it's not a very fun looter shooter it's not a great follow -up game it is if you have people to play with and friends to play with. And you always have that crew. You're always around other people as well. Maybe there's a bigger scene on the consoles. Maybe it's more popular on consoles, probably. But it really doesn't feel great. It feels laggy. The interface, interface feels rough. The shooting feels rough. There's problems with the hit scan, with the tracking. You know, very buggy, just not a great current game, I would say. But without ado, I get to play Fallout 4 next week sometime. Probably about two or three hours. You guys have a good one then.